we've been making self-portraits and we've been inspired by the work of Frida Kahlo. And so what we're gonna do is we have painted our self with our shirt and um, we're actually gonna cut all this away and mount it on a piece of colored paper to add a background. And if you've looked at some of the pictures of Frida Kahlo, you can see that she likes to have lots of plants and sometimes some animals and she would dress herself in these nice costumes. Um, sometimes she would have, you know, like a text element in there. Um, so they're very dreamlike. Um, and so what we're going to do is we're going to just draw a lot of that stuff here before we cut this out. So we're going to draw kind of past where we think the head would be and some of that's going to end up being covered up. So uh, we'll use oil pastels for this. And I have lots of these books that have ideas of plants. And these are over on that um, shelf with all the drawing books. This is a nice one. It's got birds and it's got trees. It just shows lots of different ways, you know, not just one beetle, but many. Lots of different ways to draw flowers. Here's another one that's a little bit older and rattier. And so what I'm going to do is you could start with pencil or you could use oil pastels and just go ahead and start going in there. Um, I think I'm going to make that little scroll above there. I think I'm going to go a little higher with that. And then here's a little trick. I can just, so I make this little loop here or this little uh, curved rectangle and then I can just come down like that and it looks like I've got like a little scroll unfurling and then I'm going to um, just kind of lightly color that in I'm going to come in with a, a brown and just kind of go over the edge of that so we can see it again. But I like how that red paper shows through. I'm just using multiple colors. <clears throat> and then I'm going to write my name. You could write something else. You don't have to do words. Just, that's just one of the things that we can do. And uh, I'm going to have some plants come out. And remember, this stuff here will probably get covered up, but I want it to look like it's growing out for me. I'm going to make that symmetrical. I'm going to make kind of the veins of the leaf. And then I can go around like that, and I've got a nice leaf. Yeah, you like that? Now I'm going to take a lighter green then, and just go in, color that. And I'm pressing lightly, because I like this red, that's why I picked red, so I want to have some of that red paper show through, and I like that green and red contrast. I'm just making like these U's that go around the center. I've used like three colors on almost every area here. And that's how you're going to want to do your work, is just make sure you have plenty of colors 